are the fantastic Sabian Stratus cymbals. Sabian have always been innovators when it comes to cymbal making. The cymbals are so musical and there's something for every style of music under the sun. It's been six years since Sabian launched a new series and back in 2017, they came out with the FRX line. Sabian took the last two years working with artists and industry insiders and their incredible team of designers and builders and brought to the music world the Stratus line of cymbals. This is a product that has filled a gap of sound and price. It's a professional line of cymbals that I think you're gonna definitely dig. Before we jump in any further, I ask that you like this video and subscribe to the awesome Sweetwater YouTube channel. No matter what instrument you play, you're gonna find loads of great content to help you learn and also to entertain. You can get totally lost for hours on our channel. Believe me, I've done it and I work here. There is definitely something for everybody. And then after you do that, jump on over to the awesome best in class website at sweetwater.com where you can get lost in all of the music gear goodness. Okay, back to these beauties. Like I mentioned, it took two years of research and development to bring these cymbals to market. They're made of B20 bronze alloy. And that's the best alloy for cymbal making and it's the same alloy used in all of Sabian's high end cymbals. The cymbals all start with the alloy, but it's the way they're hammered and shaped that brings out the magic in them. They use high impact hammering. It's a machine that does the hammering, but it's a person that chooses where the hammering is done. How many hammer marks, how many hammer rows, whether it's hammered on the top or the bottom of the cymbal. The artisans in the factory are serious professionals and they know exactly what to do. I've seen them in action and it's really amazing to see it up close. In the Stratus line, you get two sets of hats, 15 inch and 14 inch hats. I was playing the 15s in the opening music that you heard. There's two ride cymbals, the 22, which is the main ride cymbal I have here, and also a 20 inch ride cymbal, which I got set up over here in the back. There's three crashes, a 16, an 18, and a 20. There's an 18 inch China and an 18 inch zero crash. So now let's get into the sounds. I'm gonna start with the hats. So you heard the 15s earlier with the music, but let me play them on their own. I love 15 inch hats because that, that one inch size bigger than 14s just gives you a little more body in the sound. Both hats come with a medium light top and a medium heavy bottom. They cut while being dark, but you know, they just blend well with all the other symbols and they definitely blend well with the Stratus ride symbols. Now I have the 14s right over here. Let me play those for you as well. Great chick sound on the 14. Great chick sound on the 15. Let's see if I can demonstrate both of them back and forth for you. You can tell that pitch difference between the two and it's just one inch difference between the two hats. Now, I'll do them in a little bit of a groove for you too. Okay, let me play the 14s in a groove for you. And this is a little bit of a weird spread for my legs, uh, but I'm gonna make it happen anyway because I love you people and I want you to hear these hats. Here we go. <laughs> that 
that was fun. The 14s are great for funk music. You can get them nice and tight, so if you love playing that kind of stuff, those would be a good choice. A little bit bigger sound with the 15s for rock and roll, but either are a great choice. Now let's go to the ride cymbals. Again, a 22 and a 20. You're gonna notice the 22 inch has a nice wash to it. It's great articulation, just a great spread, and they're both really versatile cymbals. The 20 is gonna give you, again, a higher pitch because of the smaller size. Both have really strong bells. You could play all kinds of music with either one of these cymbals. In a groove for you, here we go. The 20 is thin enough to where you can crash it, but the 22's crash sound is just really big and, and whooshy and gushy and just beautiful. Now, moving on to the crashes. Again, 16, 18, and 20. Here we go. These are thin and low profiled cymbals and the high impact hammering drives the profile into a darker, slightly trashy tone. And which is really good, especially when you wanna bury the stick into the side. And the cymbals have that quote, buttery feel to them. When you do bury that stick in, you can kind of feel the stick go into the cymbal, which is what you want. You want the cymbals to give, not to be really hard. You want them to give back to you. And they, all of these definitely do that. Now on to the two great effect symbols you get in the Stratus line. We're gonna start with the China symbol. One thing you're gonna notice first off is that it has a wide lip, and that gives the symbol a very soft feel and just that dark, killer China sound. I like a China sound that has, gives you that <sighs> that kind of dark white noise sort of thing. You can really, it's perfect for old progressive rock music. I love to play that kind of stuff, but great for jazz if you wanna do it just the tip of your stick and get into that kind of thing too. You can go all kinds of places with this China symbol. Here we go. Oh yeah, very nice. Now on to the Zero Crash, which I have over here on my left. It's a combination of ozone and aero. The bigger holes bring in distortions that allow a lower range, and the little holes bring in higher distortions for a higher range, and the combination of the two give you this beautiful sound. Sabian was the first major cymbal company to put large holes in their cymbals with the Evolution Ozone over 20 years ago. So they've been doing this for a long time, and they know how to mix and match the sizes. So you get a nice, effecty, trashy sound with the, with the zero crash right here.
One thing the very smart folks at Sabin engineered into the China and the Zero is you put them together and they make a great stack sound. So I like to take my China, turn it over, grab the Zero, put it on top, play some drums. The last thing I'd like to demonstrate for you before we finish this video today is how these cymbals sound with other implements. They work really well with mallets. You get some great, nice cymbal swells. Here we go. They also sound equally beautiful with brushes. Last but not least, I have some nylon dowel sticks. And there you have it, Stratus, an awesome new line of cymbals from Sabian. Grab one or grab them all because they play really well with all kinds of other cymbals. And they would make a great addition to anybody's cymbal collection. If you want any more information on this Sabian product, just head on over to Sweetwater.com or give your Sweetwater sales engineer a call. We'll see you again soon. Cheers. Cheers.